Welcome back to YMGP, playing Hearthstone. Uh, I quickly wanted to, to record this uh, tavern brawl that there is uh, right now, because it's ending very soon. Uh, and the reason for that is that it is uh, like the single player campaign that is out now, or has been for quite a while, uh, where you choose a hero and you get this special uh, totem on the playing field. Uh, you can of course play this all you want in the single player, uh, in the solo player option, but this time you can uh, play it with, against other people around the world. So I'm just gonna pick uh, Malacrest and I can show you what is different from a normal match when we get in. Ooh, a wait time. Uh, wasn't six minutes, I can see. Let's see if it, uh, if it comes. There we go. Malakras versus Hooktas. So as you can see, you are, of course, different uh, characters, but it's the same classes. So you still have the Rogue, Warrior, Mage, Paladin, and whatnot. Um, I'm just going to keep this hand. It's actually quite good. Uh, but you have these totems, uh, and my totem gives me a frost fire each time I freeze a character, and uh, her totem does uh, uh, does double up on the spells she casts. Um, the thing that is uh, about these totems is that if you kill them, they uh, don't uh, die uh, permanently. They uh, kind of get knocked out of the field. Uh, or they turn around and they have uh, they, it takes uh, three turns to uh, to bring them back and then they just pop around again and then you can use them once again you can uh, buff them and uh, give them uh, strength and attack with them and stuff like that quite nasty that we got six of those four four the ruby and warriors in our deck now but uh, yeah, we should be able to kill this now. So at least she can't uh, toss uh, uh, double spells for at least three rounds. So that's that's good. And as you can see now, the count is on. Turns until this revives. Two. I just think it's a really fun. Um, way of uh, changing the gameplay a bit because you have these totems and they are quite powerful. Okay, we got a Nerubian warrior. Now at least we can freeze targets. So that's good. And this this uh, sh uh, shrine I have compared uh, comboed up with Frost Nova is really really insane. Yeah, but now my totems is out. Or shrine is out for three turns. That's a lot of coins you're using. Just to kill that dude? Okay. Let's not draw an Arubian warrior. Please don't draw an Arubian warrior. No. Not what was planned. Okay. Let's do this. Now oh, that's good. There we go. And now the shrine is back. So what spells do you have? You've been waiting for it. Okay, shuffle 10 cards. That means you get 20 cards of my class, okay. 
and normal mana. Was that it? Okay. I think I'm just gonna play it easy. And of course, shoot that. Couldn't you have hit it just once? Come on, you flame war waker. Okay, so one more chance to do something with your double spells. Thank you. And you did not take it. Okay, that means we get a lot of spells now. Two creatures, that means we get two spells. Three spells. Perfect. And she retired. <laughs> Perfect. Good victory. So that's just one of the heroes you of course can play, or two of them. You saw the rogue and the mage. Um, let's try out uh, one more. Let's go for the... Let's take the uh, druid. Let's see what's that up. What's, uh, that up. I can't really remember what the uh, the druid shrine is but I'm guessing we'll find out pretty soon I know that the warlock is uh, a lot about discarding cards and getting demons out and stuff like that okay so it's got a lot of rush minions, beasts of course. It's expensive cards. I think I'm gonna take these two away. And that one as well. Let's keep the spell. Just for now, let's try and get some cheaper cards. Okay, we got that one at least. I believe the Warlock, as I said, is, yeah, whenever you discard a card, summon a random demon. And we have, after you summon a minion, give it plus one, plus one. Don't know if that's that powerful. Because he could do that. Luckily, he got that demon, but that buffs up that demon. Okay. Yeah. I think I'm just gonna end the turn. Because if I can't get this out, it's okay. Let's definitely kill this little dude. Doesn't matter that much. Next turn we get this out. And that's one, two, three, four, five, six, two twos. Or maybe we should just play that. Mm, oh, the choices. We could kill this now. Make this a two, a three-two. He kills my shrine. Has to wait three. Oh, that's not dead yet. Uh, I think we need creatures. That's good. So next turn we can, if this is up and just our totem or shrine is dead. We can at least swipe this and just get rid of it. He 
doesn't really want to discard any cards. That's quite unusual. It's going to be his downfall. I think that I think I've played against some warlocks and they discard every time they can. I just think that he he has a card up on his hand that he just want, don't want to lose, but I don't really think that's a smart idea because you can get really any demon from this. I've seen some insane demons get uh, coming out to play. Just discarded his entire hand and didn't get anything from it. As I said, didn't play that well. And that's it for uh, YMGP this time. Just a quick video playing uh, Hearthstone while this uh, tavern brawl was up uh, playing against normal human beings. Uh, as I said, you can always play this solo. Uh, I highly recommend uh, if you haven't done the solo adventure in Hearthstone and the newest update uh, that you go do it. It's quite fun. I'll see you in the next video.